Welcome to this week's edition of the Falcon Report. This week is September 9th through September 23rd. Let's check in with Playworks for the game of the week. Hi Falcons! This week our game of the week is Watch Your Back Tag again. I'll be in the classroom this week and not on the playground, but you guys can come out here and play Watch Your Back Tag behind the playground if you're on Zone 1 and next to the soccer field if you're on Zone 2. Have fun! Now back to our reporter for this week's story highlights. Hi, my name is Avery and I'm here with Olive who has a joke for us. Hello. Um, why does the mushroom always get invited to the party? So, why does the mushroom always get invited to the party? Because he's a fun guy. Thank you, Olive. If you guys have a joke or riddle that you'd like to share, you can pick up a form from outside the Falcon Report room and put it in the mailbox when filled out. I can't wait to hear what you guys have come up with. Here are our high flyers for creativity. In kindergarten, we have Lila, Grayson, and Hadley. In first grade, we have Caitlin and Jones. In second grade, we have Allie and Lincoln. In third grade, we have Ariella, Nicole, and William. In fourth grade, we have Sam, Piper, and Ella. In fifth grade, we have Addie and William and Jack. For assertiveness in kindergarten, we have Grayson, Peyton, Vender, and in first grade we have Ezekiel, Azul, and in second grade we have Tyson and Addie. In third grade we have Maisie, Chelsea, and Vivian. In fourth grade we have Ahmad, Solomon, and Jason. In fifth grade we have Allie and Kayla and Trinity. For resiliency, in kindergarten, we have Max, McKay, Leon. In first grade, we have Killen. And in third grade, we have Henry. Fourth grade, we have Vivian and Henry, Samantha. In fifth grade, we have Jaslyn and Sophia and Elise. Way to go, High Flyers. We currently have 14,765 care cards. Keep up the good work, Falcons. Yay! Now I'm here with Nolan from kindergarten. Can you share with us something you've been doing in class? When I grow up, I want to be a mathematician. Fun, thank you. Now I'm here with Salome. I heard that the fire department visited third grade. Can you tell us something you learned? I learned you should get a stool to get stuff out of your microwave if it's high because if it falls, it will burn you. That's useful information. Thank you. We have some new teachers this year. We'll be spending the next few weeks getting to know them. Today I'm with Miss Petchy. Miss Petchy, where are you from? I am from Cedar Rapids, Iowa. I just moved here in August. What grade do you teach? I teach fifth grade. How long have you been teaching? This is actually my first year teaching. So I've student taught, but this is my first year having my own classroom. So not long at all, only like a month. <laughs> cool. Do you have any pets? I do. I have a little kitty at my apartment named Prince, and then I have two dogs at my parents' house in Iowa. I miss them so much. Do you have any pets? Yeah, I you have do. five. Oh my goodness, very cool. What's your favorite movie or TV show? My favorite movie, I like any Marvel superhero movie, and I also love Brother Bear. Have you seen Brother Bear? Yeah. It's a great movie. Um, TV shows, I like lots of TV shows, um, but anything Marvel, really. Marvel's my favorite. Okay. Thank you, Miss Petchy. Welcome, and welcome to Sprucewood. Thank you, Avery.
Well, hi, Sprucewood Falcons, it's Principal Skeeno here, and I'm going to bring a message to you about our safe arrival and dismissal routines. I wanna give a huge shout out to all of our Falcon students and Falcon parents who are taking care of our two main priorities, and that is keeping the flow of traffic moving and taking care of everybody's safety. Today I'd like to do a quick video just to give you some information so that everybody knows what we need to do when we're in the car line and then also to see where some of our other options are. Thank you everyone for being a positive contributor to our learning community. So if you're getting into our carpool lane, just be sure to take direction from our staff members in the vests. They'll keep everyone safe and keep the flow of traffic moving. All right, you need to pull all the way forward as much as you can. Have those kiddos jump out as quickly as they can and always walk across that white crosswalk. Don't cross if the flags are up. Wait for your safety patrol to motion you through. If the carpool line is not for you, one of our other options is Cedar Ridge. If you choose this option, it's very important to abide by the no parking signs and stay clear of the red curb area. If you choose this option, make sure you wait for the crossing guard to get you across safely. Another option is to park in the east parking lot. Watch out for kids crossing and go on in when that cone is removed. Students must always be escorted when they are walking in our parking lots. This east parking lot takes you right to the steps, which is right next to our kindergarten, first and second grades. Another location is behind our school on Hidden Valley Drive. We do have a crossing guard waiting there for your students. Please make sure that you abide by the no parking signs and avoid the red curb areas. Thank you for always using the white crosswalks. A huge thank you for showing patience and kindness whenever you're exiting and entering our school property. And just a final reminder about how to safely exit our school. Hi Falcon friends, I'm Brooke with the PTA and I'm here to talk to you and your parents about the Fun Run Obstacle Course Friday the 23rd. There's lots of ways to donate this year. There's cash and check, Venmo, credit card, debit card, Apple Pay and even PayPal. Every dollar that we collect goes back to you guys. We want to make this the best and most fun year possible. All this money goes towards reflections, class parties, water day, spirit nights, Field Day, Red and White Ribbon Week, graduation parties, and so much more. Thank you for all the support that you give your children. We really do want to make this the best year for them. And thanks, Falcon friends. I can't wait to see you at the Fun Run Obstacle Course. Here's what's happening at Spiritswood this week. Today is vision screening. Sign up, sign up for a parent-teacher conference ends Thursday the 22nd. Next Monday, the 26th, starts our book fair. Have a great week, Falcons! F-A-L-C-O-N-S We are